Ulit TV KPM. So for today, we are going to the topic of our lesson today would be tricks of the trade. So some of you might wonder what are tricks of the trade. So tricks of the trade, exact it's exactly a quick and clever way of doing something. And normally the ones who are doing it are the experts in the field. So for example, like our gimmick just now, a sale is definitely one of the tricks of the trade for yes. retailers or merchants. Okay, so this is lesson 33 taken from unit 3, buy it. And for viewers at home, you can um, open up your full blast plus 4, pages 44 and 45. So here's our learning standards for today, where we will have two. The first would be the mean skill reading 3.1.6. Recognize with support typical features at word, sentence, and text levels of an increased range of genres. And for the second one, we have the complementary skill of reading 3.1.3. Guess the meaning of unfamiliar words from clues provided by other words and by context on a wide range of familiar topics. And we have two learning objectives for today in which the first is for us to practice reading for gist, and the second is for us to guess the meaning of unknown words in context. So we're going to do a lot of guessing game today, Ms. Liana. Definitely. Ah, interesting. Sales and guessing games. <laughs> that is right, yeah. And you have two questions that you're going to be discussing with us right now. Yes, I think these two will definitely get our lesson going. So we have two questions over here, and I bet our pupils are very excited to share their opinion with us as well. OK, so we have the first question. Do you ever spend more money shopping than you intend to? If so, why do you think that happens? So anyone would like to answer that? And who would like to try? Can you raise your hand up? Ha, huh, so we have Zo. OK, Zo, share okay, with us so. your opinion. Yes. I never spend more than I intend to spend. I think that happens because the things in the mall attract us to buy it compared to the things we want to buy. Okay, thank you, Zul. So yeah, even he's one of um, even he would actually spend more than he intends to, right, yeah. Zul? Okay, for the second question, do you think that retailers influence how much you spend while shopping? How? So maybe Arif would like to get this? Uh, yes, I think the retailers use promotions to attract customers to buy things. Mm. Hmm. Yeah, I do agree, don't you? Yes, I would believe so as well. Yeah, retailers do influence how much we spend. As um, referring to our gimmick earlier, when you see a sale sign, you would immediately dash for the store. Yeah, and I can agree to that as well. Well, I think many of us might have might have done that as well, isn't it, Miss Liana? That we might mm -hmm. have spent a bit more than we intend to, especially when we are hungry and we see food that we enjoy. We've already bought one and we would like to buy more and more. Isn't that true? Yes, definitely. I myself am a victim of such <laughs> tricks. So yes, I believe um, this is one of the objectives of the lesson as well regarding the theme so that we'll be more aware of the tricks and perhaps we'll shop better and be better consumers, just like what you mentioned. DD TV KPM.